Awesome. Welcome back to Mini Lessons with Miss H. And today we're doing page 68, Unit 2, Week 2. So we've been focusing on the genre lit literary elements, right? So literary elements really mean stories that are not real stories, right? For example, fables. Fables are a type of story that are not real, right? So a fable is a made-up story that teaches a lesson, has a beginning, middle, and an end. So as we read the story, we need to think and keep in mind that this is a fable. So these are not, this is not a real story. It's a made-up story. And maybe the story is going to teach us a lesson. So think, what could be the beginning, the middle, the end of the story, and what lesson can it teach us, right? So those are the two things that let us know that this is going to be a fable. And we're learning about fables these two weeks. So always have a marker. This is my marker. Here we go. The fox and the grapes. So based on that title, I already see that it's going to be a fox and grapes. So the grapes have something important to do with the fox, right? Read it with me. One day, the fox saw a bunch of grapes high in a tree. Hmm. Setting. Character. So he's seeing something high in a tree. High in a tree, that's probably a problem, right? They're letting us know there's going to be a problem in this story. He could not reach the grapes. The fox walked away. Those grapes must be sour, he said. So he could not reach the grapes. So he's being very, very upset about it. He walked away. Those grapes must be sour, he said. Here's the lesson. It is easy to dislike something you cannot get. So you're going to hear this a lot for me in the classroom. I tend to do things in my personal life that people don't agree with, right? And that's okay because as long as I continue to do things that make me happy, my family happy, and my students happy, it doesn't matter what other people say, right? So look at the lesson here. It is easy to dislike something you cannot get. I can relate to this lesson because when I told certain teachers, hey, I'm doing YouTube videos for my kids, they immediately were like, you're crazy. That's a lot of work. That's a bad idea. Da, da, da. So it's, it's they don't see the fact that you guys are benefiting from it, right? They just dislike it because it's something they cannot do. So this is how it translates into my life. So think, maybe there's something you're really good at. Maybe you're really good at karate. You're really good at doing cartwheels or backflips. Maybe you're really good at playing Fortnite. And when you bring it up to certain people, they get upset and they get bitter and they say, oh, oh, Fortnite sucks or Fortnite's for losers or I don't know. So what? You could do a backflip, right? Remember, it is easy to dislike something you cannot get. So don't let that those negative people influence your life. So let's look at the wolf. Look at his face. I mean, the fox. I'm sorry. Look at his face. How does he look? He looks bitter grumpy, upset. So learn, there's people in this world that will always be upset when you can reach grapes they cannot reach. So let's look at the questions. Number one, how can you tell that this text is a fable? Well, what's the first thing Mr. Hernandez told you about fables? They teach us a yes. So let's steal from the question. This text is a fable because think what did Mr. Hernandez say made this a fable? Write it down. You have one minute to write down why this is this text is a fable. Ready, set, go.
What happens at the beginning of the fable? In the beginning of the fable, Fox did what? Yes, yeah, so let's steal from the story. At the beginning of the fable, Think, what did Fox, what happened in the beginning of the fable? Think. You have one minute to write it down. happens at the end of the fable at the end of the fable what did fox do at the end We have one minute to put what Fox did at the end of the fable. Ready, set? Number four, what lesson does the fable teach? The lesson is, we already did that, remember? We already wrote that. It is easy to dislike something you cannot get. So you have one minute to write that, the lesson of the fable right there at the bottom, okay? One minute, hold on, let me zoom out. There. You have one minute to do that. Ready? Awesome. Let's review. So remember, 
A fable is a made-up story that teaches a lesson. It has a beginning, a middle, and an end. In the beginning of the fox and the grapes, Fox saw a bunch of grapes high in a tree, right? That was already a problem for Fox because he wasn't that tall. In the end of our fable, he walked away. The lesson is, it is easy to dislike something that you cannot get. Remember, Mr. Hernandez already told you about this. Sometimes people will see you doing things that are beautiful and great, and you have to keep going. You cannot let people make you dislike something they cannot get. All right? Hit that notification button. Bell. <laughs> Hit the notification bell to stay up to date with the coolest homework vids ever. And don't forget to put in the comment section, what is something you're really, really good at? What are your grapes? Mr. Hernandez's grapes are making YouTube videos. Thanks. We'll see you next time. Bye.